you're looking for your nearest wise strap doctor, just visit my website, drjosephcipriano.com. Click the tab locations and you'll be able to find doctors that perform the wise strap adjustment near you. And if you're a fellow chiropractor out there watching and you use the wise strap also, visit the site, find out how you can be listed on here as well. So, this is like... Okay, so the scoliosis, so it's starting, goes to the left in the beginning, and then over to the right, okay. And then my um, neck is forward? Yes, so that is considered a reversed cervical curve in the neck. Yeah, and then I only had like four. Okay, yeah, that's an L5 spot. This spacing looks, looks good, let's make sure. Yeah, it looks like you put a little bit of pressure on your L5 right in through here, but nothing. Mm -hmm. No. I got one more. Oh, let me see. Okay, that need to be open mouth. See, right, okay. Spinous processes are rotating to the left through the lower cervical, upper thoracic. And it's staying to the left all the way up. Okay. So now, obviously after looking at the x-rays, everything mm -hmm. going on, what are you feeling? Um, it's like a constant dull ache that radiates, like down, um, and pressure on my lower back. Okay. And then um, my chiropractor um, in Charlotte, he said that my hips are like, cause my hips hurt. So he said everything is like unaligned. So it's making my hips hurt. Yeah, I mean, I saw in that x-ray. So it starts off L5, it's kind of going off to the left and then it's yeah. kind of going like a slight scoliosis to the right there. But, okay. So you just got a little bit of, a little bit of everything. Yeah. Okay. Are there any positions or anything that kind of Worsens the pain um, if you're looking up or down or. Well, if I if I like stand up and put like my shoulders back against the wall, mm -hmm. like like I'll pass out. Like it gets black, and then I get like very lightheaded. Okay. I don't know if like my misalignment is pinching a nerve or something. Somebody told me that. I don't. They were in a doctor though. Okay. <laughs> but I don't know what's going on with that. Okay. Let me have you lay face down on the table. Yep. There's any pain or tenderness with this? There was some right here. Okay, so right in that cervical spine, kind of going into that upper thoracic as well. There. Okay. Mm -hmm. There. Alright, so. There. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, so we got it. So right in that mid-back and then also in that lumbar spine, lower lumbar even going into the SI joints and sacrum. Okay, let's check the leg length. Good, legs are balanced, hips are balanced. I am going to start with the massage gun. I just want to relax everything mm -hmm. for you.
Take a deep breath in and out. One more time, deep breath in and out. Let me have you sit up on the table and then bring one leg up on the other side for me. Perfect. Okay. I'm bring one arm up. Bring the other arm up here. Good. I'll rotate it just like that. Okay. okay. You can relax your arms. And mm -hmm. lay face down again for me, please. From here, I'm going to stabilize on the sacrum. Let me have you raise your right leg up. Any pain as with that? As much as I can go? Yeah, as much as you can. Any pain with that? Um, tightness. I feel like pain in here when I lift this leg up. Okay. Now, let me have you raise the left side up. That one looks, seemed like it went up higher. Yeah, that one was not as tense as the left. Okay. So first, actually, let me get you to drop um, like an inch down on the table. Perfect. Okay. Cross your right foot over your left foot. Good. Table's gonna pop up. Yeah. Uncross. that right leg up again for me. How'd that feel? Um, it feels fine. Okay. Doesn't seem too convincing for me. <laughs> <laughs> feels the same. Okay. So what I'm gonna have you do, I want you to lay on your side and you can face this way first. Okay. Okay, let me. Yeah, shoulder up. Good, good. So I want the bottom leg straight. Have you flip to the other side. There we go. Okay, lay flat on your back for me. I'm gonna bring this down just a little bit. There you go. So from here, we're gonna do the leg pulls. Down just yeah, it's right there. 
Now we're gonna use the wire strap. Mm. So we're gonna decompress the spine here. Basically when you crack your like your hand knuckles but it's in your back. <laughs> oh it feels like basically your spine just definitely decompressed. <laughs> Yeah, he had a ton of movement. I know you felt that. We heard that. Yeah, I can't wait to watch the video. <laughs> I felt it like slowly popping in the neck when you were... Just... Yeah. Correct, I know. And I it just... was just like, poop, poop, poop. <laughs> poop, 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 poop. <laughs> I felt to like go, I guess like right here. Like up to here. I was wondering if I was going to like feel it all the way down, but... Sometimes you do. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's a big move. Uh, can I lay can I lay on my side? Of course you can. Do you recommend like no? no activity after this for like the rest of the day? I have everyone tell everyone to just relax and rest. Can you help me out? Yes, of uh. course. <laughs> I feel like if I let go, you don't get on a I did have a Valentine's Day party to go to. <laughs> that I already paid a ticket for. But I could just go and sit down, right? Of course. Like, of course. I'm not gonna like dance or drink. I'm just gonna. I tell everyone today, just rest, relax, so, you know, heavy lifting, anything like that. So definitely no liquor today, or does it really matter? <laughs> drink some water first. Okay. Yeah, definitely drink some water first. You know what? I'm gonna just drink water the whole night. No liquor. Are we still rolling? Them. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. <laughs> it's Jahari from New Jersey. <laughs> now it's Charlotte. Okay. Ooh, can I stretch? Uh -huh. Yeah, how did that feel? Uh, uh, oh. I'm probably gonna go find a spot to relax before I drive back. Any anywhere you think is a good place to just hang out and relax. What do you feel like? Just somewhere to sit before I drive two hours back. I would say. You probably don't recommend. Do you recommend like driving two hours after I just got this done? You'd be fine, but I definitely rest a little bit first. Yeah. Literally not even a block. Well, it's about two blocks from here. Um, there's two really good coffee shops that I go to. Mm -hmm. um, one's Coffee Underground, the other's Methodical. Okay. Those two are, and they're literally walking. Okay. <laughs> so should the, <clears throat> should I walk? Like, should I like do a slow walk? Just yeah, like, you'd, yeah, you'd be good with that. I feel like I need to walk. <laughs> I feel like I need to not just sit down. I feel like I need to, whew. Okay. So, like, how often do you recommend this? I like to shoot for about four times a year. Four times a year? Yeah. So every three months? Yep. Okay. It's 
So you recommend, uh, I've watched so many of your videos, but I'm just gonna make sure. Ice or heat? Ice. Ice, okay. Yeah. See, with time already, I know you were worried right after that wise job. I know in general you were you were nervous and whatnot in the beginning, but now that you're up and moving, you're starting to notice that difference. I know the initial pull is it's shocking. But yeah. Hopefully it helps with my my shoulder pain. Cause I have like radiating dull pain all the time so the spine that got cracked that never got cracked before so. <laughs> cracked that never got cracked <laughs> well yeah just rest alrighty